So here's the, uh, the pattern on the snare drum. And it doesn't help to, you know, it does help to do little rhythms with your mouth, you know, pretend you're doing a hi-hat or something like that. Now I will add the bass drum. Okay, so then uh, you want to add hi-hat or cymbals or anything. You can add anything and uh, tom-toms or whatever. Be dynamic. Maybe, maybe you play the hi-hat loud. Maybe when you hit the cymbal, you play it very soft or do something like that. And uh, just be, have different levels of dynamics and make it very, you know, musical. And speed it up. You know, anything that you do fast, you have to learn it slow in order to do it fast. And a lot of people learn patterns and they want to quickly build it up to warp five speed. It's like, that's how the pattern goes? Okay. And it doesn't work like that. You have to understand it at a slow pace in order to do it fast, in order to make it effective. Otherwise, you're just making a bunch of noise and you don't know what you're doing because you didn't take the time to learn it slow. So, and when you speed it up, it sounds like you're adding a whole bunch of different notes, but you're not. It's just the same pattern, but it's just sped up faster, and it just sounds like you're adding different things, so I'll demonstrate it.